Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well. May the Lord Jesus Christ bless you and keep you safe. Today I want to remind humanity of a dream the Lord gave me a few weeks ago. The Lord keeps reminding me of this dream and he gave me confirmation the other day. In the dream, I was told that Jesus would return in the year 1023. I remember asking while I was still in the dream, how can this be? We were living in the year 2022. When the Lord woke me up from the dream, I wrote down the year 1023. I want to mention that this is not the first time that the Lord gives me numbers in dreams. Sometimes I need to do the math to find out the answer. I knew in the spirit that the year given in the dream was not literally the year. And I began to add the numbers. As I add them, it gave me the number 6. I removed the 0 and I multiplied the numbers. And again, it gave me the same number. I counted six years from now, and the year will be 2028. 20, the Lord keeps on showing me those numbers almost every day. Either in the clock, dates, anything that has to do with numbers. The other day, the Lord confirmed this year. I received by mail a card. I look at the card, and as I was looking at the numbers, and you can see the card right here in this picture. I had to cover some of the information for privacy, but in this card, I saw the number of the year that was given in the dream. You can see the number 1023. But look at the expiration date of the card. When I saw it, I knew this was a confirmation from the Lord. What are the odds of me getting a card with the same year that I dreamed of a week before and the expiration date of the year 2028. Usually a car doesn't last that long to expire. It usually expires within two or four years, but not six. God is very serious with these messages. I'm just doing the job to bring the message to you. You must pray and ask God to give you understanding. These messages are very important and we must take them very serious. Jesus Christ is coming back very soon, and we must be ready. I know that nobody knows the day or the hour. But in this dream, I was given the year. Not the day, not the hour, but the year. Another thing, if we add the numbers of the year 2028, for example, 2 plus 0 plus 2 plus 8, the answer is 12. The number 12 is a perfect number. It symbolizes God's power and authority. It can also mean completeness or the nation of Israel as a whole. Jacob had 12 sons, which are the 12 tribes of Israel. Jesus gathered 12 disciples. The New Jerusalem has 12 gates. And if we multiply the numbers of the year 2028, 20, for example, 2 times 0 times 2 times 8, the answer is 0. Zero time. There's no more time. The Lord is not slow in keeping this promise, as some understand slowness. Instead, He's patient with you, not wanting anyone to perish, but everyone to come to repentance. I pray that people will open their eyes to see the truth, ears to hear the truth, Soften their hearts so that they can come to repentance before it's too late. May the Lord Jesus Christ bless you, give you understanding, and keep you safe.